In this video, my first half photo walk. What happened? Well, um, yesterday I knew it would be cloudy and uh, it would be windy as well, so I could have some problems with noise. And the weather forecast was cloudy. No sunshine, no rain, cloudy. You guess what? It started raining. Just a little, just a little more, then it poured and it poured. Well, um, it would have been a strange photo walk uh, anyway, because I had this uh, uh, meet up with, uh, with my brother in, uh, in Amsterdam. And um, so it would be kind of difficult to make uh, uh, a round trip in uh, Amsterdam, starting Central Station, ending Central Station. So um, I'll show you the video, but uh, I think um, sound is so bad, um, I better do a voiceover. Finally back in Amsterdam. It's been a whole week. You're looking here at Central Station. It's uh, built in the 19th century. Well, here comes the voiceover. I wanted to take uh, some footage from uh, the tram, but uh, Unfortunately, uh, the one I should uh, have used was uh, just leaving, as you can see here. Um, this is line 2, it's uh, a tram crossing most of uh, Amsterdam. Uh, so if you want to go uh, sightseeing Amsterdam, uh, remember number 2 is the one you uh, should take. Um, I'm going for a walk and I will uh, walk uh, to a new size Voorburg and from there I will uh, walk to Heisbui. Um, this is uh, the eye. Um, on the right hand side there is this uh, island um, the station is built on. This uh, building in front is uh, the Victoria Hotel. There's a little story to tell about that hotel uh, I will do in a minute. It's built, uh, I guess, in the 19th century. Not sure. We'll have to look that up. I should wear short skirts. Maybe they will stop me as well. There on the right you have the Victoria Hotel. As a matter of fact, this is a nice hotel. It's built around a little house. It was from a filing builder. And he wouldn't sell it to the hotel. So the hotel owners decided to build just around his house and leave the house at his place. This is the little house of the violin builder. Well, you can buy some souvenirs uh, now. I'm walking towards Nieuwezijds Voorburg. Bicycles in Amsterdam is just pure madness. So here we are, New Sides for the Hall. Here uh, the wind took control of my uh, microphone. So um, I wanted to uh, stop filming here, but um, I saw just one nice picture. 
Um, on the right hand side there was a, a nice wall with just one guy. Let me put the image in here. Well, okay. And yes, those guys were blowing. I still, still can smell them. Okay. Nice little, little alley. Jakobstraat. It's, uh, you can reach it from the new side forward. Move on on the new sides. In fact, I should take out my analog camera, my Canon S28, and take some pictures with that. Oh well. Right inside Magna Plaza, left inside, you see a little top of the church. And behind the church you will have the Royal Palace and Dam Square. And I will uh, go there and take some pictures. This is the uh, Royal Palace, the right hand side. Now we have on the left side the church. Walking towards Dom's Square. This guy sits there every day. He's acting as if he's blind, but I'm not sure he is. No, look at that, that's a nice picture. In fact, let me take one. Well, it's a Tuesday, and obviously it's not as busy as in the weekend. Then we got a drawer, I guess. A drawer. <laughs> Dam Square is famous because of pigeons. There, because the Royal Palace. Just let me take a look for sure. No, no flag. So the king and queen are not here. This is the Spaustraat. And there we go. turn back to the Spy Square. As you can see, all kinds of pubs and restaurants. Actually, I like to come here. When the weather is nice, it's a little bit crowded here. Yeah.
And if you're in Amsterdam, don't expect anyone to speak Dutch. Only tourists, yeah.